<clears throat> Hello. It's episode two of Red Dead Redemption 2. We're gonna hop right in because I'm bored and I don't have anything better to do. If you hear my phone going off in the background, you can yell at my friends. Let's do this. I thought I liked action. Couple of days on the land. You lot have all turned yellow, apart from you. Shut up, Micah. I hate, oh, I hate Micah. So many long faces. Mm. I guess, I guess folks missed it. I fell, I fall. I don't want no fucks. When you fall, there'll be a party. <laughs> party. <laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. Funny, huh? Sure. Sorry, I had to turn notification. Oh! Yeah, I had to turn notifications off on my phone. For real. You sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Folks been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. The last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Como O'Driscoll. Let's go. He's right. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You, you always uh, say the is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Martha. Take this. And this is about nah. then revenge for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators here. Cole always had good information. Come on. And you think now is the right time to hit it so? Now you might fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit. Well, I completely forget him saying that. Mr. Matthews, Mr. Smith, Mr. Pearson. Would you please look after the place? There are O'Driscoll's about. Yeah. Southwest, right, Arthur? Yeah. He said follow the main trail southwest. They're camped near some lake. Okay. Lake Isabella. Oh, I love this game. No, I can't express it enough. I mean, come on. I got like 1,300 hours in it. <laughs> so yeah, I'm still finding new things to do. I was trying to running out, but you know. I just found out about the Carolina parakeets, so I'm trying to do those. As far as I can tell, the only fools out here are us and them. They must be this way. You good, Dutch? Of course. Listen, I know you don't think much of my ideas recently, but this is especially later in the story. Okay. You know I got you back. I learned a long time ago that you hit Como Driscoll. Wait for him, and people you love will die. This feud between you and him needs to be put to rest, one way or another. <laughs> it will be. Some Shut up, Bill. I can forgive, others I can't forget. What he did to Annabelle, I can't do Who even is Annabelle? We never learned who Annabelle is. Yes, I did. And I hope the bastards will be reunited soon enough. That's how this will end. Shut up, Micah. Let's cut up here and take a look. They said it was no, 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 so meet me, Ryan. Hold up here. All right, gentlemen. This is it. You, what, you clapping? Good. Now, Mr. Morgan and I, we're gonna head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williams, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position. I'm gonna be more quiet this episode, so maybe not a lot of talking. You two, hold position here. 
Let's go. Hey, do this. I really like um Duchess coat. It's super cool. I also really like Arthur's coat. That's why you walk going around here. That's definitely them. Home? Oh, I think so. Yeah, that's him. Guy in the funny hat. Hmm? There's old Kieran. Old Kieran. Who's he talking to? He don't seem very happy. No. No, he don't. Oh. They leaving? Seem to be. Should we go get him? No. Cone can wait. Best to get some of them out of there. And much less fun. There's old Kieran. Score if he never finds out about it. Come on, let's get down there. Come on now, let's do the snow physic in this game. We're like actually good though. Look, look at that. It's better than most. All right. Don't forget to grab that rifle from your horse. You boys be ready to pick them off from up there. Sure thing. Let me get that off you. Whoa! Around the far side and go down that way, same as Mike and Bill. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur. Dutch doesn't agree as much. Completely lost faith in me. Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including coal. Dude, I'm, I'm gonna be honest. Chapter two is a oh my god season or seat season <laughs> chapter. Like it's one of my favorites. Right next to chapter four. I mean, come on, it can not be topped, bro. It's awesome. Season or chapter two is a goat though. I got a friend who watches these videos, and I think that's really about it. But uh. At least someone's watching them. <laughs> Shout out to Jabroni Macaroni, aka Braxton. <laughs> no, I'm not really gonna watch out. Let me be honest with you. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no. All right, no, we go. We go. We go. Ooh, this is a cool little rock formation. <sighs> Have you seen the um? Things where it's like um, the strange man is always watching you, and it shows every little bit of mission where he's watching you. Like um, the chapter two train robbery, or chapter three train robbery, where you stand on top of the oil wagon. He's watching you stand on top of the oil wagon. No, but the way I look's been running. Hush, let's just get down there first. Come on, why can't I run? Yeah, real quick, you're walking like my grandpa. Stay low. Come on, follow me. Oh, come on, follow me. Yeah, they're really not hearing us right now, aren't they? Getting cover, Arthur. Getting in cover. Oh my god, why's my guy running now? Why is Arthur running? I got What Okay, well. Okay, um. Well, I, I, I suck apparently. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, I guess these guys suck more, don't they? I haven't been hit a single time. Oh, no more, no more, no more, no, 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 no! Eh, shut up, Dutch. Oh, Billy, you killed him. Nice. Alrighty, then. You recognize any of them, Dutch? Of course not. Cole doesn't give a damn about his men. All he cares about is numbers. So you can shoot a gun, ride a horse, and kill without thought. You're in. He's not wrong. That's the guy we uh, released from the guy who jumped us. That guy right there. We released him. Uh oh. Can I loot one more body, please? Thank you. I just need to. I need the loot. Dutch. Dutch. I need the loot. I'm sorry, that's cringe. Ooh, that was nice. I always like these little kill cams that they got. So we advance. They should have more decisions like that in the game, but they don't. That's what sucks. Like they should have, but it should like affect the story. It's, it should be like that. Like kind of like a, a telltale thing, you know. You you decide. Yeah. Ooh, dead eye. I hate auto aim, dead eye. Run away. Good work, boys. Oh, my ear itches. Okay. Let's wait for Javier and Lenny. They're coming down with the horses. Keep an eye out for any more of the bastards. Shut up. Micah, you just suck. Yep, you got it, boss. Bill, you go search that wagon there. Mike, search that building. Arthur, you take that building to the left. I'm mean, gonna lose some more bodies, alright? No. I'm not gonna go. I'm gonna take my sweet old time. Nah, think about it. Do none of these guys have money on them? Okay, then, fine. Screw you. Oh, fine, I'll get it. I'll get it. Don't worry. Hmm. It's probably frozen. That Kentucky bourbon is. Stuff over here. Some crackers. Vegetables. What is this? Corn? Beans. <clears throat> beans is a vegetable? No idea. Come on, with something good. Miracle tonic. No, I'm good with that. Oh, health care. Hey. Can I pass that up? Oh, look at that. This looks good. What do you think, Bill? Well, looks fine. Smells good. Why are you sniffing? Come on. Did we get everything? Think so, boss? 
Found this on one of them. Thank you. This is perfect. Oh, yeah. Interesting. This is something about the train they was gonna rob. A Mr. Leviticus Cornball. Huh. Mount back off. Don't we know that name, huh? At least later in the story we do. Let's get out of here. Howdy, you boys. Thank you. Good work, fellas. Not bad for some starving down and out. Oh, I'm about to sneeze. I'm about to blow. Ooh. Nope, nope, I lied. I ain't seasoned. Uh, oh. Oh, really now? Of course you will, just like all the rest. But we're gonna stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind Blackwater. That won't happen again. All right, dig in, fellas. Let's make some ground. <sighs> Allergies. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm gonna have like a start up as a YouTuber, be like a big YouTuber, and then be on a Sunny V2 video. Oh, hey, looks like we're in Kieran. I got it. Come here, Karen. <laughs> That's kind of cool. Dude, that's not that hard to get out of, bro. That's that's not that hard. You're coming with me. You're, you're coming with me. Let's loot him. This is uh, very kind of you. I'm no use to you, really. I have four bucks to my name. Please don't. Shut up. Now the fun starts. What's your name, boy? I don't know. You don't know your name? It's Karen. Duffy. That just makes it so much better, huh? <laughs> oh wow! <laughs> wow, That's kind of cool. I like this. Okay. Look at this. Uh, this is cool. Name your price. I don't want to die, mister. Name your price. I already stole the money off you. Because I will break every bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Not one more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay. Okay. That's two bones right there. Ha. <laughs> oh, you just treat people like little kids. Here we are. You sat there. Shit. Let's head 
introduce you to the boys. The boys. All right, Karen. Come on. Don't hurt me, please. Uh, don't worry. You're real nice. <laughs> you found a little shit, did you? Yeah. <laughs> I got him. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. You want me to make him talk? Oh no, now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. Who shoot fellas is need shooting. Save fellas is need saving. And feed them is need feeding. We are gonna find out what you need. I can't believe it! What are you you're that what? I didn't even know Driscoll listened! I, I hate that fella! Oh whatever you say, son! Well done, Arthur. Well done there, Arthur. <coughs> oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. Alright now, alright now, I'll just go now. I hate that feller. <laughs> it's been a bad few weeks. But Dutch being Dutch, he is busy making plans. And Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. We never really figure out Dutch's plan. Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respect, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. You still here, then? I owe you. Yeah. And you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Arthur. I think it's time for Arthur. Want me to come? Of course I do, but look at it. I was always <laughs> ugly, man. It's just a scratch. Lie still. There ain't no scratch. The boy wanted to see you, John. He'd see me now. What's left of me? What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. Bide your time. You'll see plenty of that. You're a rotten man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. No, me, 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 right here. Bill, now you ride ahead and set the charge. At the water oh, wow, it's nice and sunny now. Ain't the problem. Why are we doing this? Weather's breaking, we could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Come on. What do you want from me, Jose? I just don't want any more folks to die. Poor oh, Jose, I love him. We're living, look at me. We're living, even you. But we need money. Everything we have is in Blackwater. You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just... I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. I like how in-game characters are modeled after their voice actors, too. Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, Dutchie. Who is Leviticus Cornwall? He's a big railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for him. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Mm-hmm. Really? It's time to make something of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We have a train to run. Yeah! No, oh, he didn't do it. Right. Uh, ooh, that was bad. Okay, gentlemen, listen up, all of you. According to the information so kindly provided to us by the Odrisco, the train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're going to pick it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. Charles, you'll keep lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Good. I'll take the driver and engineer then run the point. Lenny and Javier, you two take the front cars and deal with any guards. Arthur, 
Man, I love this game. It's so good. It's my beautiful game in my entire life. <laughs> you and me with her. <laughs> Yeah, dude. Yes, so. Of course, but huh? Now, let let her out. <laughs> Sorry. God, the music in this game, it is crazy. He's only like 18. Just happy we're back at it, Dutch. You sure you're ready for this, kid? Of course I'm ready. Just stay calm. Keep your eyes sharp. That goes for all of you. No mistakes. Not again. So we do this, then we go back to Blackwater to collect. Oh my god, no. There's old Bill all the way down there. Is Bill there? Yeah. You want to head down? See how he's getting on? Okay. Hey, Bill. 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 Hey, Bill. Bill. Oh, that, that was a hill. I'm sorry. It's gonna be funny, man. And that's a slime sickle joke, anyways. I can't even say it. It's not original. Hey, Bill boy. Hey, Billy boy. Hey, Billy Bob. Need some assistance? How you getting on? Yeah. I'm okay. You sure? Of course. Can I help a little? All right. Go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Okay, sure. I just unspool hey, brother. and then attach it to said detonator. That's cool. That's actually really cool. And honestly, I wish this TNT went off, like, really bad. Bill, now I need to run back up this hill. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry. What's going on? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. Okay? I think so. Okay, cover your faces. 
Cranny should be here. Cranny minute now. Gentlemen, it's time. It's time, fellas. Good luck, Polly. You all know what to do. Here we go. Shit! No! What? Oh, you have got to be kidding me! Where did you find that more? I just realized I just saw Bill start kicking the thing. <laughs> That was funny. Go to start kicking the crap out of the little detonator box. There he goes. He's gone. Get out our knife, because we're gonna stab some fillers. Oh my god. Hey, hey, no, no. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, well, now we're in kind of a predicament. <laughs> Right in the heart. Heart and head, you know what I'm saying? Come be like head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes. Oh crap, I'm getting shot at. Oh, that was kind of cinematic. Head, shoulders, and there's a guy, bam! I got him alright. I'm on my shoulder wheel. Brother. Sorry. No, that sounds wrong. Okay. Now I'm definitely getting edge restricted. Even though I'm the age that should be being restricted. Oh, get him, lady! Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Forget how low his health is. I have max health and like 97% save. Oh, that was cool. Oh, that was so cool. You two all right? Yeah, let's get the money and go. We got some fellas holed up in this last car. Yes. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. We don't want to kill any of you. 
any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. Beat up this Cornwall. Okay, you asked for it. Five, four, three, two, one. Teams are friends. Have gone deaf. Let's wake him up a little. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys go blow that door open. Now, don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Seems good enough. Now, light the fuse. Here we go. What do they do? Do they have, like, a flint piece on their, like, like, um... Boot or something? I don't know. Like, what? What is it? Because they just go down their boot and go. And that's very cool. Uh... Get out of here now, fellers. That's what I done thought. Search that train. Where'd my hat go? <laughs> Let me in now. Thank you. Whoa. <laughs> oh, you two got in the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. Oh, I love cake. <laughs> me and Arthur did all the work. Yeah, kid did good. And see you actually jump on that train. He's keen. I'll give you that. Keen. He's keen. I could have found something. <sighs> nice. Oh, there's Cornwall himself right there. There's us a Cornwall. I ain't leaving yet. I still got stuff to get. Oh, yeah, that bill stack. I'm keeping that stuff for myself right there. That's what I'm talking about. <clears throat> Ooh. Ooh. What did you find? These bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. Bearer bonds? Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, get it out of here. What about them? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> It's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us, okay? See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride! Here yeah. Okay, get on the train. Quick, Holly. Any bright ideas, I kill all three. So behave. Come on, move. We won't tell a soul. I swear. Just done what I thought. <laughs> uh huh. Let's just get out of here. So I had a, again, like I said, skedaddle, so. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Huh. Hey, hey!
I'm gonna get copyrighted for that one. I'm gonna get copyrighted for that one. Oh, I like this mission. We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed a Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. Well then, let's go. Yep. Clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Jose. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. Wait, I know, I'm sorry, I'm doing something retarded. Or... But I just need to get the photo. No, no, it's not good. It's not good. Well, oh, hold on. Hold on. No. No. Oh, 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 maybe, maybe. No, no, no. Nah. Nah, nah, it's not it. It's not it. Uh-oh, the wheel. And there we go. Okay. Let's take a look. You all right, partner? Everything looks all right. What's going on? That he sound that sounds like it's not the first time he's done that. So useless after. <laughs> Not quite. Not quite. There's the Indians. What do you think? If they wanted trouble, we wouldn't have seen them. Poor bastards. <laughs> Charles just and looked at him. Come on, let's not push our luck. What happened? Well, get in. I'll tell you. Story time. 
Usually I just do expanded. I don't, I don't know why. Just so, <laughs> we can do off. <laughs> really wanted. Oh God, no! This is gonna be this terrible. Is the we're going to. Good farming and grazing country. Oh. They lost it all. So, get away from them. It was every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the right. Patients in the middle of nowhere. How's that doing from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? We don't. In spite of that, just talk. He's not wrong. I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our block-headed driver here. <laughs> hey, don't blame it on me. Never forget, this is a con man, Charles, born and bred. Just because he <laughs> sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. Yeah. So, what happened to your child? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. Oh yeah, extra wide camera. So we our people for a while, a number of free men did. When we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. Hot. Oh, life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother, took her somewhere. We never saw her again. We drifted around. He was a very sad man, and the drink had a mean hold on him. Around 13, I just took off on my own. Mm -hmm. You found young Arthur here, maybe a little older. A wilder delinquent you never did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. Wait, I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Yeah, it's a long story. We've got a long time. Are we still heading the right way? That depends. Are we still heading west in search of fortune and repose in virgin forests as we planned? No. Are we heading in the correct direction on our desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? Yes, I believe so. You know this area? A little. Mm -hmm. time. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls. Our kind of place. Driscoll's? Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. And this place we're going. Wait, but what's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. It's a good place to lie low. It'll do for now. And how low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? It's just, you know, maybe it's me who's changed, not him. But... I'm sorry, I'm just uh, really sleepy right now. <laughs> Almost there, and we're gonna go flying. We're about to hit this deer. Ha ha ha. Hey, Javier.
Come on now. I don't got forever. Okay, let's go. Any trouble getting in here, Javier? Nope. Went well. This is a good spot. Excellent. I think this will work for us, Arthur. For now, anyway. Here we are, gentlemen. Home sweet home. Home sweet home. Huh? Quite the home. This place is perfect. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now. No, straight. Alright, I think, uh, get an end of the recording here, you know? We have all made mistakes over the years, but I kept us together, kept us alive, kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long. Hey, don't worry, don't worry. And now we are stuck. East of the Grizzlies and out of money, and a long way from a dream of Virgin Land in the West. I know, my brother, but we are safe. We make a bit of money here, then we move again, head out around them, be west of Uncle Sam, in a few months, buy some land. I hope so. Would you just look around you? This world has its consolations. <laughs> Gentlemen. I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. I prefer robbing banks to usury. Seems more huh. dignified. Yeah, no, you ain't that dignified. I'm gonna be honest with you, man. Put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. Quickly now. I know that things have been tough, but we are safe now, and we are far too... So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, get to work but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Wait off when we shut down our factory to the north. But get out there and see what you can find. Uncle, Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> it is time for everyone to earn their key. Keep. There is a town. I don't know. I don't want to do it anymore, man. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, the cannon gets its slice. Now be sensible out there. Alrighty, bitch. I'm ready, Mr. Morton. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. Can we put you over here? I'm sure everything will be fine, Mr. Shaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, don't remind me. Well, huh. We can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson, I've seen shit with more common sense than you do it. Oh, God. God. Chapter 2, Horseshoe Overlook. Alright, well, that's about to wrap it up for this episode um, of the Red Dead Redemption 2, Episode 2, Episode of Red Dead Redemption 2, Episode 2 of the Slade Shipley Podcast Channel. What? How was it a week later? Oh my god, like a month later. <laughs> Uh, I guess, um, probably about two weeks, yeah, uh, from this period. Once more. I can see he's thinking a little clearer. I think we all feel a little happier. Alrighty, well, that's gonna wrap her up for uh, this episode. So, um, oh no, no mind. <laughs> It is. There's a bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. 
And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm gonna read a book. I'm gonna read a book. Yeah, I don't blame him. All right. Um, I I'm gonna you know I might hang around a little bit after the episode, upgrade some weapons, earn a little bit of money, but that's about it. So, <laughs> guys, I did some things behind the episode, <laughs> chapter three. So, uh, yeah, I'm glad I got to continue this longer than the Subnautica thing. So, yep. See you later. Okay.